Hey guys, I am making this video to hopefully end hacking in Geometry Dash once and for all. Many people have been hiding hacks and it has indefinitely caused a toxic community. Recently, Xander has confessed to hacking Zodiac and nobody even flinched before his confession. I have for you guys a completely flawless hacking method that cannot be exposed in any way to the community. This is the same method I believe Stormfly uses, though I have no idea if he hacks or not, but I strongly believe he does, hence why I'm making this video. So for this hacking method, you will require Cheat Engine, Mega Hack V5 by Absolute Gamer, and editing software. Personally, I use a free software called DaVinci Resolve, and you should be using OBS or a different recording software. There's no fancy tools to it, so let's move to step one. Create or play a level using a main song. Let's take a list demon, Arctic Arena. For example, it uses the song Theory of Everything 2. Open Cheat Engine and and mega hack v5. Go to the search bar and type speed and click on anti speed hack on the tool. On Qi Engine, open the process bar at the top left and select geometry dash and click enable speed hack. You can set it to whatever speed you would like. Play the level. Whilst recording, you can make a few runs or level or beat it. But remember, it has to use a song built into geometry dash as the orbs always pulse the same no matter what speed it's at. Open your editing software and speed the level back up to normal speed. You'll notice the orbs pulse the same, sync, up, sync the level up with the music and make sure you edit the sound effects in perfectly if you have had it enabled. If not and you die in the level, cut the song off at the right frame so nobody will notice anything. The easiest way around this is replacing the song with a copyright free version so you can make excuses for the song not syncing perfectly. Now render this. You can have multiple runs of the same level as long as the song always cuts off at the right point after every death, and you can call this raw footage if you want to. Now you have your final product.